I get better at the promos. I had some real good promos, believe it or not, up in Calgary. There's still some of them floating around. Yeah, you spent uh, a fair amount of time deuced, up there as well. I was too. deuced up there, you know, and, you know, it was right after after Vince. And, but, yeah, I, uh, that, it's so easy at those places. You get freewheel, too, you know. And that's yeah. where I got into, like, ad-libbing, improv I think. I think it, that, that probably helped me carry over into acting. Oh, there's no doubt. I, I definitely, definitely agree. What was Stu Hart like up there? Stu was a great guy. Stu was a great guy. He liked the stretcher. He tried to get to me a stretch a couple of times, but I didn't fall for it. But he, uh, <laughs> solid guy, you know, loved the business, loved his kids. I had dinner at his house almost every Sunday with the boys. So I felt that was very uh, fortunate to do that. I mean, we, we had a spread. We would have, you know, those, those chicken roasters you see rotating at like Whole Foods and stuff. He had one yep. of those, like you see at a carnival. And they'd be like six, seven chickens. And they would feed us in the heart living room or dining room where all the pictures of the hearts were. They had 13 kids. And I thought that I was very fortunate to experience that. Yeah, that's pretty damn cool. And obviously, Stu is such a legend and all of his kids. I mean, most of them became uh, big-time legends. In the oh, yeah. Were you close with any of the Hart boys? Uh, probably Brett. I was pretty, very close with Um while we were on the road and stuff, uh, we traveled sometimes together. And Jim Neidhart, because he was a power lifter at first and great football player, too. Yep. So we had something in common. And, um, yeah, even after uh, I, I, I stayed in touch with him a couple times. But he was really down to earth. I, I wasn't really connected with Owen that much, even though he was part of the crew. But. I was more connected with Brett. Probably because of the trips, you know, we used to share rides and stuff, you know. Yep. It's, it's, it's very easy to get, um, you know, to get accustomed with someone when you're riding. You, you talk about a lot of shit, you know. Were you a big partier at all? Was I what? A big partier, like a drinker. And uh, that not kind of really. Stuff? Not really, no. I... I, because I, I had to lift. That was my gimmick. So that was my first and foremost thing to to go there into a town, get the lifting done, then go home and and relax until the match. Thank you for watching the Hannibal TV. Please like this video if you enjoyed it, and click the subscribe button to not miss any of our latest shoot interviews, match videos, or news updates. Follow us on Twitter at the Hannibal TV for instant updates.